Kamu gak senior. <laughs> I think the toughest part is, uh, you know, winning the trust of an athlete. Because the beginning of success in coaching is to win the trust. That's my philosophy. Without winning the trust of an athlete, um, I find it, you know, you don't really call a relationship, coach-athlete relationship. Because the, the, the glue should be trust. From 2001 we've been here, uh, we've been developing gradually, and I think the record speaks for itself that uh, over that period we've had so many successful stories coming out of this place, people running world records, people winning Olympic uh, world championships, gold medals. What drove me into running is the, the fact that I realized many athletes with a lot of potential miss the possibility of having a coach help them to achieve that potential. But what is interesting and that's what is making me learn a lot is the dynamics in, in a human being, you know. Unfortunately, in 1996, I got uh, a car accident and it was very bad. And because of that, I have to stop running. Joe Sermans, and the founder of Global Com Communication, when I was in the hospital, he said, no problem. When you, when you are okay, you can manage athletes. And after six months, I joined Global Sports Communication. I was the first one to start individual training in Ethiopia, especially in a marathon, there are a lot of marathon runners. Uh, for marathon, is uh, my coach to get an atasama. Just uh, I learned too much too for get an atasama. Uh, I'm running to 2008 in London marathon with Agai Kabada, and I ran for there. I going to together with him, and uh, after 30 kilometer, I have big injury in my stomach. And the uh, doctor say, ah, now I think uh, maybe for next time uh, it's not possible to run the marathon. Yes, the other times very bad news for me. And uh, Joe's, uh, ah, you are, uh, uh, I think it's better to focus the coaching. Please learn to school and just I give, I help you. And uh, after that, just I'm starting in the university. Mijn dromen vroeger waren de wereld zien, dat heb ik zeker gedaan. Ik denk mede daardoor dat ik me nu heel erg goed kan inzetten om de dromen van anderen te verwezenlijken. Ik ben de, de, de trainer hier in Oeganda van het kamp wat vier jaar geleden is opgericht door, door Global. Je mag dat niet zo snel over jezelf zeggen, maar ik denk dat het wel een hele belangrijke rol is geworden. Vooral omdat ik stabiliteit gebracht heb en dat atleten... Uh, echt continu achter elkaar op een hoog niveau presteren. En ja, ik denk dat het mij gelukt is om uh, atleten ook uh, ja, zo te motiveren van, uh, dat ze niet tevreden zijn met uh, uh, ja, twee goede prestaties uh, en dat het daarna afgelopen is. You know, when the athletes come, you know, to the system, we first of all set individual goals. And uh, with those individual goals, that is already a point of reference that I'm dealing with this athlete who is going to this direction. So when you're in a group, your profile of where you want to go as an athlete gives me the ability to follow you as a roadmap. As an outsider, at least training as a group, you think they are training just like a pool. But actually, to me as a coach, I see individuals in a group. The interesting that we have here is that any young athlete that comes on board, we assign them a mentor. And they are the ones who pick actually. They'll say, I want to be uh, mentored by Geoffrey or Fate or Elliot. And 
those top athletes, they also have a role on the young ones. So what we normally do is that uh, we use them to, to be the, the, the kites. The, the key thing is to make sure they understand that they didn't start at that level. Their, their success was a long journey. And when they enter into that kind of arrangement that we have here, they should know that um, you know, we are only starting a journey, and this is a long journey. Before we get to the level of faith, Geoffrey and Elliot, it, it takes time. In, in, in Kaptagat Global Training Camp, the, the center as it is, is run by athletes. Uh, they have a, what is called a president, who is now the boss of the whole thing, uh, gives directions, and under that president, there are different departments. There's a department that deals with the, the, their basic needs, the hygiene situation. We, we do our own water system here. And they, they analyze, you know, of course with our guidance, we tell them this is okay. And they execute, they, they do the budget for the week, for themselves. I mean, we, we don't interfere. So it's, it's like they are at home planning for their families. And it has helped us to build their mental strength when it comes to tra training and running. Het leukste van het training geven vind ik toch, als ik, als ik eerlijk ben, ja, de, de, de jonge atleten, de, de upcomings. In mijn, ja, je moet ook uh, hun leren om een gegeven moment steeds zelfstandiger te worden en, en steeds minder afhankelijk van, uh, van de coach. Joshua loopt wereldrecord zonder dat ik daar aanwezig ben. Nou, dat, dat is, vind ik voor mezelf, uh, het grootste compliment. Geleidelijkheid in mijn aanpak is altijd wel uh, heel belangrijk uh, geweest, hè, de rode draad. Ik heb gelukkig de gelegenheid gekregen, en dat is natuurlijk niet Afrikaans, om dat hier ook te doen. Uh, ja, met een Joshua die natuurlijk toen ik begon al wereldkampioen junioren was. Maar ook daar heb ik de gelegenheid gekregen om het stap bij stap op te bouwen. En ja, dat is naar mijn mening ook gewoon uh, de belangrijkste reden uh, van dat, dat hij nu dit uh, niveau gehaald heeft. En ja, uh, in mijn, uh, naar mijn mening, er is nog een stapje uh, mogelijk dit jaar. Qua trainingen doe ik het hier echt wel op een andere manier dan in, in Nederland. Eh, omdat ik hier veel meer afwisseling kan aanbrengen door onze omgeving eh, die we hier hebben. Eh, ja, qua benaderingen van, van de atleten zelf, ja, het is een totaal andere cultuur. Als trainer, je bent een metselaar. Je bouwt de carrière van een atleet steen bij steen bij steen op. You uh, rolling to everything to the athletes, even the private life, even the training, even the social life. If maybe for the athlete, maybe the, his family is for that, he go to together with him. If uh, maybe something happened to his house, you go to together with him. Everywhere, especially in Africa, you roll off the everything to the athletes. You know, for even the athletes uh, happy, he is told uh, discuss with you. If that is sad, also is discussed together with you. So the teamwork in, in athletics, uh, nothing to do to alone. Just uh, sharing idea and then uh, help to your friends. When I start coaching, I have learned them. You have to be disciplined. You have to be disciplined for your training. Go train, come back and sleep and eat, rest and go back train. When I start uh, tra training them, I said every day two times. I have learned them how to train and how to stay disciplined. I see that my athletes are uh, performing. They are giving us best performance. Why I change? Because I don't hurt them and I, I don't damage them. There is very low injury and the performance is very good. Why I change? I'm happy with that. There is always competition. But as a coach, I have to find a solution to, uh, to keep them together. And that is challenging, to be honest. That is challenging. Somebody is com uh, coming better and better, also you, 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 you make a group around him. 
It is like that. Because I have 50 athletes and, and working with 50 of them is sometimes too difficult. You know, it's not a journey with an end. It's a journey with no end. And I, as long as I still have that passion, and the passion to me is what I see changing in other people's lives. The more I see change, the more I get excited. And I get a lot of adrenaline pumping, you know, making me continue to, to wake up uh, in weird hours. Bouw de carrière van een atleet rustig op, dan, dan uiteindelijk kom je het, uh, het vesten. Ja, in je benadering uh, uh, blijf dicht bij jezelf. Probeer niet een andere trainer te kopiëren, uh, maar, maar uh, 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 gebruik je eigen persoonlijkheid uh, daarbij. Ja, is mijn opinie de beste part of de coaching. Dat helpt to atleet. Help to people. Whatever, whatever it came to for anywhere, even Europe, even Africa, just help to athletes and get good results. I have taught many times, uh, how, so many years, uh, running and coaching. Uh, why, why am? Why I'm keeping doing it, you know? I'm asking my, myself also. But next year you will find me there. So it is my blood, so I can't quit. I can't quit. I don't know why. This is a secret. <laughs>